My mum came to Canberra to marry my father in January 1943, but it was really only in the 1970s, early 1970s, that she um, discovered, found that she wanted to be an artist. Mount Stromlo um, was important because it was on Mount Stromlo that she became familiar with the Australian landscape and it was on Mount Stromlo that she developed the practices of uh, exploring the landscape, of uh, honing, uh, of uh, looking at um, the grasses and the trees and familiarising herself with the, the way the light f fell on the landscape and all the variations of the things in it. Well, it's a very personal collection because it does represent a lot of personal relationships that are important in my parents' lives. There are three works by Carl Plater and another one acquired through him. The Michael Taylor is, a, is a, a, I guess, a drawing on paper uh, with a lot of with collage elements in it. Michael was very important in my mother's early career. Uh, she met him in 1972, just after she'd bought a painting of his and struck up a very a firm friendship with them. Michael and his wife Romney would come and visit Mum when they were in Canberra because they lived in Redbow. And they would have long, long conversations and Mum said, he fed something in me, a hunger in me. Uh, this was very much the time when Mum was doing this transition from other creative pursuits into an artist. He gave my mother a lot of encouragement and was instrumental in uh, bringing about her first two shows. Rosalie Gascoigne is one of the most important artists to have emerged uh, from the ACT and uh, to have uh, works which are of such great personal significance and offer such important insight into her life and into the life of the couple and into the life of their family. Uh, this is really uh, a, a tremendous treasure for, for our purposes.